Hello everyone, welcome to Sweet Tomato Vine Homestead. I'm Linda, and today I'm in my garden and I am doing a cleanup and a harvest. So I'm not gonna be doing very much talking, I'm just gonna be cleaning. I got someone out here helping me today. I'm very thankful for that. So we're gonna get it cleaned up, get some things harvested, and I already got stung by a walls, so y'all know I got a little mad, but I'm all right. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and get some things cleaned up and then I'll uh, show you all my harvest and I'll show you what it looks like after we get some of these um, plants taken out.
I told Miss Renee I was going to tell her. I told Miss Renee at Renee's Garden that I was going to tell her what type of pepper this is because she gave me some Cubanelle pepper seeds. And I want to see if this is the Cubanelle pepper. It says it's a lipstick pepper, but I don't think this is a, lip, a lipstick pepper. It could be. Y'all let me know if this is, let me know if this is a lipstick pepper. But that's what this label says, that this is a lipstick pepper. I really thought that it was a cubanelle. All I know is it is delicious. It's a sweet pepper. I even found a red onion over there. It ended up getting chopped, but it's still gonna be good. I'll just go ahead, slice it up, and use it today. I told y'all we were going to check today to see if there are some potatoes in one of these beds. I can't remember which bed it was in. All I remember is that it was in an onion bed. I dug some onions up and there were some potatoes. There's an onion. A little small onion. It's a red onion. And this is one of my onion beds, but these beds have logs in the bottom of them. So, you know, when you have a bed this size, you have to use something in the bottom of these beds to uh, take up some of that space. But I really, really do not care for having the logs in the bottom of this bed because I don't think I would have put any potatoes in here on purpose with these logs in the bottom because there's no space for those potatoes to grow. But this, per this bed is perfect for growing onions. I don't think that it was this bed that had the potatoes in it. So let's try another one of these beds. a little tiny potato but this is not the potato that I saw the potato that I saw was larger than this so I just put that back in this bed has a lot of roots in it so it's gonna need I'm gonna need to pull some of these roots out before I plant. I know you can't plant with roots in there, but I'm not gonna pull all of them, but I will pull some of them out. Okay, so this is the harvest for today, and I'm going to share it with our friend who came to help us. So I hope that y'all have enjoyed this video today and that you give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell to be notified when I upload a new video. And as always, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.